welcome to the Andy Griffith Show, Facts and Trivia. Appreciate you being here. Um, before we get started, yes, Hal Smith was in a pornographic movie. We'll get to that later. Uh, before we get started, we ask you to please subscribe. Um, we ask you to uh, please share these out. Appreciate it. A um, little bit about Hal Smith. Uh, he's credited for over 300 films and television productions. Of course, he was best known for Otis, uh, the town drunk, and playing Al in Winnie the Pooh. Um, after he graduated high school, he worked from 1936 to 1943 as a DJ and voice talent for WIBX Radio in New York. Um, being an avid flyer, he enlisted in the United States Army Air Force in 1943 and was stationed in the Philippines with the Army Special Service Division. Right there, he's already one little place in my heart as my wife is from the Philippines and is a beautiful, beautiful place. Um, while in Manila, he has made uh, he was made assistant manager of the enlisted men's club at the Far East Air Force headquarters. Um, he was responsible for planning and directing shows for the entertainment of his fellow troops. His own performing skills were utilized as well in a show titled Strictly from Hunger. He was discharged from the service in 1946 as a sergeant and was awarded the American Campaign Medal, the Asiatic Pacific Campaign Medal, the World War II Victory Medal, and the Philippine Liberation Medal. Um, after the war, he traveled to Hollywood and appeared on many television shows, such as uh, I'm Mary Joan, Fury, The People's Choice, Ozzie and Harriet, Donna Reed, and so on. Um, of course, he was best known for being Otis, right? Uh, although Hal Smith himself was pretty much the exact opposite of Otis. He did not drink. Um, but, uh, boy, did he play it up well. Uh, he's one of the best, uh, actors doing that portrayal that I've ever seen. Uh, Don Knotts did well, too, I thought. Uh, but, but, uh, Hal Smith was a really good, uh, quote-unquote drunk. Um, as a matter of fact, the, uh, the Otis character stopped appearing in the sitcom towards the end of the series because of sponsor concerns regarding the comic portrayal of excessive drinking. Uh, but he did appear as Calver Weems in the Don Knotts comedy, The Ghost and Mr. Chicken, in 1966, playing essentially the same character. Uh, he would go on to play Otis one more time in the television movie Return to Mayberry. Um, Smith later used his Otis Campbell character in commercial spots for Mothers Against Drunk Driving. And he appeared as Otis in Alan Jackson's music video, Don't Rock the Jukebox. Um, did a lot of voice acting for uh, uh, Hanna-Barbera, Walt Disney, Warner Brothers, uh, Sid Marty Croft, The Flintstones, um, Pink Panther, The Merry Adventures of Winnie the Pooh, Mickey Mouse, Yogi Bear, and Looney Tunes. Um, let me get down to this one part here. Yes, folks, he was in a pornographic animated movie. Also played um, Mother Goose in uh, the X-rated animated feature film Once Upon a Girl in 1976. Um, Once Upon a Girl is a 76 American adult live action animated fantasy comedy pornographic film written, produced, and directed by Don Jurek. Uh, it was animated by a group of animators who had worked for Walt Disney Productions and Hanna-Barbera, according to the director, in an interview included with the DVD release. A lewd old lady claiming to be Mother Goose, which was played by Hal Smith, uh, has been put on trial for obscenity due to telling her the true versions of famous fairy tales. Her evidence is presented as a collection of pornographic animated shorts, those of Jack and the Beanstalk, Cinderella, and Little Red Riding Hood. Um, don't know why he would do such a thing, but I am not here to judge. I'm just here to give facts. 
Um, after his wife died in 1992, Smith's own health began to deter deteriorate rapidly. On January 28, 1994, at the age of 77, he died from an apparent heart attack. Now, Don Pitts, his longtime agent, said Smith died at his home in Santa Monica, California, while he was listening to a nightly drama hour on radio. Anyway, that's all I got for you. Uh, except uh, I did want to say, um, in the uh, movie Return to Mayberry, uh, Andy wanted to drop the character of Otis because of the drinking thing, and that's why they made him sober in it, so they could keep the character. Um, just a little bit of trivia. Uh, remember, don't judge. You don't know why he did it. But Hal Smith, Otis Campbell, did porn. Anyway, have a great day. Uh, we'll catch you tomorrow. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to share. Um, God bless.